hello guys welcome to how to fix rack in this video guys we are going to fix the bluetooth related issues so let me show you the error first if i go to search bar then type here bluetooth and other devices setting now you can see there is no on off button when i click on add device bluetooth you can see could not connect so if you are getting the same issue bluetooth is not available on your laptop or on your pc this video is for you so we will troubleshoot this issue step by step so first of all we need to make sure that the bluetooth services is running on your windows okay so in order to check that go to windows search bar type here services and run it as administrator or you can press window plus r button together type as services dot msc like this and hit ok you will get the same windows once you click on that window you need to look for bluetooth related services here click anywhere on it and type b on your keyboard and you will need to first look for bluetooth audio gateway service you can see it is stop now you can see i'm getting the start option but you need to right click on the bluetooth audio gateway service go to its properties and startup type should be automatic here this option okay and start the service click on apply click on okay do the same thing with the bluetooth support service right click go to properties okay manual choose is automatic and apply okay it is already running and bluetooth user support right click go to properties and this you need to leave it as default click on start but it should be running so all three services are running here you can see the status is running okay so let me check now my bluetooth is working or not okay still there is no bluetooth option in my settings so so the still bluetooth is not working so we need to go to the second method in the second method we will go to the device manager to check the bluetooth driver there okay open the device manager okay now you can see there is no bluetooth so bluetooth must be here in order to run properly okay sometime it is hidden so go to view and show hidden devices it should come back but still not you can see here so we need to manually add the hardware on our laptop so go to action first we need to select the this option the name of the laptop go to action then click on add legacy hardware click on next click on install hardware that i manually install this option next okay and look for network adapters this option click on next and it will retrieve all the information related to the drivers so one by one you need to look for bluetooth okay intel we need to only look for bluetooth related driver here and then if you found it you need to click on next option okay still not there realtek okay so i can't able to find the bluetooth here if you found any bluetooth navigate carefully okay one by one and click on next and install the hardware after the hardware install it should be coming here but in my case still not there so go to action scan for hardware changes
okay so bluetooth option is still not in my windows so still i have the same problem so i need to install the bluetooth driver manually from the browser so open the google chrome and on the search bar you need to type a intel bluetooth driver for windows 11 and this will work also in a windows 10 okay go to first link enter wireless bluetooth for windows 10 and 11 now you can see this is the latest driver here just click on this option second option this is for 64 bit this is for 62 bit just click on 64 bit accept terms and conditions how to check 64 bit system you have go to system information and here is system 64 bit based okay so now bluetooth driver is downloaded now so i'm going to download folder here is and let me cut it from here and go to the desktop so that you can see properly okay here is the bluetooth driver just you need to double click on the this driver okay click on next now click on next accept terms and condition click on next and you need to choose this option complete In click on install and this should fix your issue the intel wireless bluetooth driver will work mostly hardware so click on finish so once you finish you need to restart your system so let me restart my system and i will continue after the restart okay so i have restarted my system and let me show the error is gone or not okay here is you can see the on off button is visible here and the my problem has been solved here you can see it is adding the device here so okay so this is how you can troubleshoot this issue so still you have the problem what you need to do is you need to since you are on a this page so go to this option type a troubleshoot and you will see the troubleshoot setting you can directly go to the search bar type there troubleshoot setting click on other troubleshooter and look for bluetooth and run the service okay this is asking the sign in option here in my case but you can okay so run the troubleshooter if you can run it from directly here okay and also go to windows update and make sure choose this option install all the updates and install all the pending updates here turn on this toggle and click on install all okay and also install on once the installation is done after that restart your system and your issue should fix so in my previous video most of the user are not able to access the bluetooth with the intel wireless driver so we can go to the manufacturer driver here so go to manufacturer driver so how to do that go to first system properties and look for the dell brand or whatever brand you have you can see this is my system name dell and the manufacturer is dell okay so go to search bar type a dell driver download and if you have hp laptop hp driver download same thing you need to type and lenovo lenovo driver download this option okay and i'm going to dell driver click on dell drivers first link and you need to give the serial number here so go to cmd and run it as administrator tap this command wmic bios get serial number together number and hit ok hit enter okay once you hit enter copy the serial number 
and you need to paste it here and click on then now once you put the sn key here you need to click on search option okay now you need to look for find my driver this option and search the keyword here like i'm choosing here let me refresh the space okay so this is automatically detect my if not you can go to this option and look for bluetooth now you can see you can also choose the this option bluetooth and wireless okay you just need to click on that and click on download wi-fi and bluetooth driver and you can also double click on the same setups the same steps you need to follow you can see install select language click on next and installing the driver now you will get the windows like this click on next click on install now you can see finish option click on finish and you need to restart your system after that okay so click on restart and your issue should fix okay so this is how you can troubleshoot this issue so hope your issue is fixed now if your issue is still not fixed you can flush the power do the power flush remove all the peripherals from your usb mouse all the peripheral from your laptop or the system and press the power key for 30 seconds and then release it your issue should fix so this is how you can troubleshoot this issue now your issue should fix if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix that